Right, evening everyone. Hopefully everyone is all well. Let's flick that over. Let's pop onto there. There we go. Yeah, that background there is just because I paused it. Um, anyway, let's see who we have got in. Uh, we're on the Brighton main line today. Uh, this was at the request of Davidoff. Obviously, big thanks again, Davidoff, for the donation. Uh, we've got Gaming Worm, Amela, Kishore, 313, Devon, Metra, Ron. Uh, we've got Mr. Quicko, Train Fan TV, British Train Spire, who did actually give us the 442 pack. So, big thanks for that. Russian Dog, Archer, uh, Mr. Quicko, Devon, uh, E60, uh, Pet. South Coast Transport, John. Uh, and the laptop's being very slow. There we go. Um, but yeah, today we're going to be doing a service to Gatwick from London, Victoria, and then back to London, Victoria. So we're doing, I suppose, half the route in a way. Oh, no, you're about to depart with this Gatwick Express service down to Gatwick Airport and then form the return back to London, Victoria. Open the doors and allow passengers to board here at London, Victoria before departing. Hello, Jeff. Hello, Rob. Hello, Luke. How is everybody doing? Uh, right, let's get the doors open. Which I didn't actually get this set up before, uh, but British Transport has told me I do need to press this. Uh, anyway, I if that'll work now. Yeah, okay, there. Yeah, I got ya. So we need to press this here. I think. There we go. Hello, Jaffa, how are you? Right, just wait in here at Victoria on platform 18 at the moment. Uh, DR8, we'll keep that on for now. Uh, yeah. So we're just waiting. So we'll get that off for now as well. Uh, go by Clapham Junction. Let's get that off. But how is everybody doing this evening? Hopefully everyone's all well. What we drive in, the class 442, which obviously is the older Gatwick Express. And we are ready to go. Put it into shunt. Hopefully we can get power. Oh god, here we go. What have I not done this time? <laughs> Let's have a look. Oh god, I, I've done something. Oh god, now that comes on. See, I usually don't get, I don't manage to get this going. This is the AP enhancement to it, I believe. Right, you go off. Do you think I should buy this route on the sale? Definitely. Hello, Little River, how are you? British train spot, here know what's wrong. What's wrong? Why are we not going? It's broken again. <laughs> Let's have a look. But yeah, this is the um Oh actually we do need to get the uh headlights on and the tail lights off. There's for some reason the tail lights are on. Let's get them sorted. Uh, they're down here I believe. Uh tail lights, let's get them off. There we go, Didn't, don't need that on. There you go, well that's that all sorted. Now we just need to get going. Um, let's get the instrument lights on as well. Instrument lights are there. I think I'm going to get an Xbox Series X this week. Awesome. Yeah, parking brake is now off. I feel like we don't have power. Or are the doors open? The doors might be open. No, they're not open. Um, got the horn on it. Press the blue button on the desk. The blue button on the desk. Oh, okay, the doors are still open. Okay. I suppose this is an AP enhancement pack, so there's slight differences. There we go. We're off. No one worry. What is my laptop loading up? It's just loading up Discord for no reason. Unbelievable. And it just can't respond because uh, I don't know. Right, let's get going. Hopefully, you guys can hear. It's fairly quiet coming out of here. Okay, for tail lights. Hey, Pete, how are you, mate? Let's um, get that off. Many of should have said, yeah, I, I thought they closed automatically, like, uh, well, see the usual TS stuff. That's good, yeah, 4-4-2 tonight. We've got 32 people in, so thanks all for coming in. But we are heading down to Gatwick Airport. Once we get down to Gatwick Airport, we're going to switch ends and go back to London, Victoria. So we're sort of on the more city side of the route today. And we have got the AP Enhancement Pack, or one of the 
packed for the 4-4-2. Four to, to, four, four, Obviously, big thanks to British Train Spotter for that. How long until the Brighton main line? I'm not too sure, John. You're on fours there, awesome. But yeah, how's everyone doing? Good to see you, Pete. Doesn't sound like we're getting power, does it? Oh, God, what have we done now? No, we were getting a bit of power. It's just steep up here. Afternoon, Pivers. If you go to centre coach, you have motor sounds. Okay, let's go and let's actually see if they're on. No. no. Well, there we are going. Yeah, just uh, fairly steep up there. Hello, Davidoff. You're good. Good to see you. I'm good. Hey, awesome, Amela. Let's see. Uh, pick up passengers at Gatwick Airport, which is in 26 miles from here. There we go. The key is, then would you be in the key? They <laughs> ready to put bird mess on the window. Realistic, isn't it? What is on the left top pound window? That is uh, what comes out of a bird. Yes. There's Battersea Park. Obviously, on the Train Sim World 2 version, we aren't getting the 442 as this thing retired uh, for Gatwick Express uh, about five years ago now. Uh, we're getting the newer 387. Sure is, Davidoff? Well, actually, if we want, if we, when we get down to Gatwick, we'll then come out of this scenario and then we'll go into the 387 and do that from Gatwick to Brighton. What do you want to see? Shall we go, just put, I don't know, put Brighton or London in the chat? London, if you want us to then go back to London in this, or we can go in the 387 and go the rest of the way to Brighton. I didn't know, I didn't, Pete. I was doing a few bits on the PC. <laughs> it sure is. If you press 5 and control right arrow, you get your head out of you. Oh, yeah, look at that. Cool. Oh no, not the oh, the wipers have come on now. What have I done? There they are. There we go. Right, okay, well, we'll go on the 387 once we get to Gatwick then. So do half and half. Cool. Gatwick oh, Gardens are bright and nice. You pick the new one, see. Up to 60, we are fast through Clapham Junction. Which obviously not a lot of services are. Got a desire over there, obviously a 450. Cool, can I have 377, I think underneath. You're on the East Coastway, awesome. Yeah, I'm a good man, Cheese, how are you? Yeah, we'll have to do the um, West Coast Main Line at some point, Pete, again. You just got the 319 pack, awesome. Right, going through Clapham Junction. How's it looking? Hopefully it's looking all good. And running nicely for you guys. Through we go. In train some more to Ryan Root, about to get ready for a few nighttime regional expresses. Awesome, Devon. You didn't turn the headlights on. The headlights are on. Uh, well, they were last time I checked. There they are. TSW is going to lack so many of the other locos that makes this route busy. It's still going to be very busy, Crazy Killer. Uh, without, you know, say the 455, the southwest stuff. It's going to be very, very busy. I mean, Southern is the primary um, operator on this route, so. Oh, awesome, Rob. I mean, they've already said it's going to be the busiest route in, in Trains and World 2. So, it's going to be very busy. Not too sure, Mr. Quicker. I'm guessing you're going to play Boston Sprinter. Yeah, it is a bit of an odd-looking train at the front, but it's a cool train, though. How do you get the passenger view on this one? Is there not a passenger view? I know there is with the um, normal one. Let's have a look. Oh, no, this is the passenger view. Wandsworth Common. 
Oh, blimey, Russian dog. That sounds uh, safe. Uh, good Davidoff, yeah. And yeah, if you're enjoying today's stream, do thank Davidoff. We did actually uh, request we do do the Brighton mainline. Oh, I say. But yeah, we'll go in the class 387 once we get to Gatwick Airport and we'll go from Gatwick to Brighton. Also, the 387 is going to be coming to train some World 2. Here's Balham and very loud church bells. Oh, that sounds like a nice flight, Rob. Yeah, sounds good, mate. Cool. But yeah, good to be back on the BML. But yeah, really looking forward to it uh, in TSW2. Finished my service. I'm now on the West Coast Mainline South, Birmingham to London. Awesome. Uh, I, I guess so, British Transport, yeah. I haven't noticed a big difference, but I think it is, uh, I suppose, working. Damn, we have to have it off the plane then. Oh, I see, uh, Mr. Quicko. Yeah, that'd be cool. Well, 387 in a 442 Galaxy Express livery. That would look interesting. Yeah, the Gatwick Express has a bit of a weird story, doesn't it? Because it started off, well, they got, what was it, the 460s, which were modern, built to be the Gatwick Express. And then they all sort of just started breaking and just weren't, because they were a micro fleet, it just didn't really work out. So they replaced it with these old things, which weren't, well, aren't as suited to airport runs. I mean, they are fairly cramped inside. I think I only have actually went on one of these once. And that was when there was like engineering work, so they just said, right, everyone just get on the Gatwick Express. There's the Sutton and Mole Valley line going off there. That is an alternative way to get to Horsham. Obviously, it goes through uh, Leatherhead, Dorking, down that way. Hello, King Carter, about so we now in Train Simulator. We're coming out on Glenn's favourite station, Streatham Common. Let's actually whiz ahead. What's the train going by? There it goes. Get back in. Awesome three on three. I mean, you could, yeah, you could. That is a that is a good idea, three on three. Obviously, the power of the livery designer. You've got the Tees Valley line. Awesome, Vincent. Let's well, say a lovely line. A bit of uh, in industry and countryside. And can we try and get up to 30 likes? We've got 40 people in, so thanks all for coming in. Here's Norbury. Yeah, that's the uh, Great Western Railway, 166, uh, that one, Pivers. But that's uh, that's not a Gap Express, but I mean, it's sort of the fast service from there. But I remember seeing it years ago. Oh. On TSW2 BML, we will have at least 450 services. Awesome, Mr. Quicko. <laughs> Fair enough, King Carrot. Yeah, we're going to go all the way to Brighton. So we'll take this as far as Gatwick. And then we're going to switch over to the 387. Um, which we'll take the rest of the way to Brighton. Alright, Metro. They all merge together, eh? Coming up on Thornton Heath, that's just along here. There's one of those mad church bells going off again. Hello Snackbeck, how are you? Yeah, the 769, that's uh, the sort of revamped 319, isn't it? It's quite cool to sit back on the, on the BML. I don't know Davidoff, mate. I, I don't know what time I'll get it. I, I don't know Davidoff, mate. Sounds like the brakes come on when you do that horn. Here's Thornton Heath. One in for a 60, let's bring that down. Cool. Yeah, hopefully it's running well for you guys and looking good and well sounding good. So do let me know. Let's have a Pete check. Pete, is it looking and sounding okay? Right, coming up on Selhurst. 
Um, but you do have to sell her stepper, which is cool. She's over there. Awesome. Awesome gaming room. The first ever Gatwick Expresses were actually Southern Rail. No, I they the men uh, were four two threes. Oh, they are blue and grey. Lovely. Coming up on East Croydon, speed does come down to forty five. Let's bring that down. It's quite slow through here. There you go. You just got four DM from a load of people asking for the power. <laughs> I'm pretty strange, but yeah, fair enough, Pete. Right, this is East Croydon. There we go. Which I'll see on TSW2, I would imagine, will be the modern day. You know, because it'll be. It'll just look much modern. Because at the moment, it's sort of. Well, on this game, it's sort of set in 20, 2012. There's been quite a few big changes since. Hello, Neil. How are you, mate? You like East Croydon? Awesome. But yeah, it's, it is quiet in the cab as the motors are in the middle coach. So it's a bit like the 395 where the motors are slightly further back so you can't actually hear hear it. So it's fairly quiet in the cab. Let's get that back up. We're sort of on the final sprint down to Gatwick now from East Croydon. It's 16 miles to Gatwick. It goes up to 90 miles an hour in a second. Here's South Croydon Station. Obviously, you get the line off to uh, East Grinstead and Arkfield. Obviously, it then does split off at Oxted. Good to you, Neil. And I think it splits up her screen, actually, I think. Lovely. Going a bit quicker now, up to 90, let's go. Yeah, good to you, Neil, mate. How are you getting on with um, Boston Sprinter, mate? And can we try and get a few more? Can we try and get up to 30 likes? But let's go, we can probably get a bit of speed now. Let's whiz ahead of the train and watch it whizzing by. Oh, that is really quick. There it goes. We see five car units on these. Let's get back in. Here's Pearly Oaks. You're listening to a song used in the 2016 Disney film. Oh, I'm guessing that's You're Welcome, isn't it? I can't already guess. You're on South Eastern High Speed in Train Summer 2. First time in a while. Awesome King Carrot. Right, coming up on Pearly. Still at full throttle. And so we are on the fast line, so the speed is 90. They're whizzing along here. Are there very much difference on PS5 compared to PS4? Or is it just graphics? Uh, there's quite a big difference in terms of the last gen version, obviously on the PlayStation 4, and the next gen version on the PS5. Uh, obviously, yeah, big one is graphics. Uh, second is the amount of services. So you do get sort of more uh, on a few of the routes. You do get a few more services um, because well, it can handle more. So graphics, uh, a bit, a few more services. Obviously, it just runs better. Um, but it's it's just, it's just better. 
Good to Sam, how much money is Bustin 21 going to be on console £45, on PC £30? I bet you haven't done that. I haven't yet. No, not yet, uh, Pete. I don't mind, Mr. Quicko, mate. I mean, we did do the chat and mainline, so. More than welcome to, mate. There's Coulston South Station on the left. Well, I think that's cool. Yeah, it would be Coulston South. Yeah, that's true, Pete. It does sound um, just clearer. And, yeah. Looking forward for the patch just because it adds something to it. Fair enough. <laughs> That'd be cool, 313. I think it'll probably be more than that for the whole of England. But yeah, we are going to change over to the class 387. Uh, obviously, the Armstrong Powerhouse one once we get to. Gatwick Airport. Obviously, that one will be coming to Train Sim World 2. Yeah, you've got the slow line down there, which obviously then goes to Merston, Red Hill, Ellswood. But we're going past all of those stations. Hello, Kobe. How are you? Hello, Mason. You're on the phone now while I was watching. Fair enough. Awesome British train spotter. How you doing, Shayna? Yeah, cheers, Mr. Quicko. Alright, Russian dog. We are really going along. So it's just down here, and we'll be into the quarry tunnel, which will take us out over the M25. Hello, Ashton. What route do you think TSW2 off to the Brighton Main Line? What would you pick? Uh, what well, if there was any route which could ever come to the game and I wanted it? The Brighton Main Line's already coming. <laughs> Obviously, the only route we know of so far after rush hour is the West Cornwall local at the moment, I believe. Obviously, that one's by Rivet Games. But we're now in the quarry tunnel. Good to Shane, I'm good. Evening, Josh, how are you? And can we try and get up to 30 likes? Can we get a bit of a like spike? Uh, we do actually have another stream after this, probably fairly soon after this, and that will be back on Rapid Transit, as the last stream we did on Rapid Transit was somehow back in May, <laughs> so uh, I don't know how it's been that long, but uh, yeah, we'll be on Rapid Transit after. I wonder if you can change the destinations on here, I think you can, it's up there at Gatwick. Oh, right, three and three. Do you think they will add more routes to the roadmap? No clue. Have to wait and see. Obviously, it's uh, Tuesday, isn't the roadmap? Go over the M25 in a second. There's the M25. Yeah, shooting our way along. Good to Josh, I'm good. Would you be getting Train Sim 2022? I sure will be. I mean, I already have two of the routes from it. Uh, obviously, Washington to Baltimore and uh, uh, the Birmingham Cross City line. That'd be cool to play Frankfurt to Cobb Lens. Alright, Russian Doe. Let's get back in. Alright, you 60. Right, it does come down to 80 miles an hour uh, when we get up to Red Hill Tunnel. So I'm going to let it come down naturally. I'm sure I'm free, I'm free. Looking forward to it. I mean, the previews have been amazing of Razor Dresden. So really looking forward to getting on it and playing. But September the 9th. Oh, I see Davidoff. Who's that? How can you get Train Sim 2022? Well, when it comes out, that's when you can get it, obviously, on Steam, I would imagine. I haven't, Metro, no. See you, 3 on 3. Thanks for coming in, mate. Coming up on Red Hill Tunnel. It does change the brake pressure, actually, when you do that. No clue, John. No clue, mate. Welcome back, British Train Spot called Jake. Oh. Hello, 
Let's get that up. Goes back up to 90 in a second. You can see the 90 board coming up. There's Ellswood Station there. So we completely bypassed um, Merstham, uh, Red Hill, and what well, there's Ellswood there. When does it release? Train Sim 2022. Um, I'm not sure when it releases, but we do know we are getting the Birmingham Cross City line with it, the Frankfurt to Koblenz route, and the North East Corridor Washington to Baltimore, and the Deluxe Edition route hasn't been announced yet. Yeah, that's true, Amanda. When the Brighton Main Line is in Train Sim World 2, what train sim well or train would you prefer? The 377 or the 387? I'm not too sure. Yeah, I'm not really too sure. Um, yeah, I'm I'm not too sure what I prefer. Probably still the three seven seven, <laughs> but I don't know. It's, it's it would be a tough decision. Oh, oh does it British trains? But I mean that sort of I suppose would happen in real life. Right, we'll see Salford Station next. Yeah, see you, Josh. Thanks for coming in, mate. But I mean, when the Brighton Main Line does come out for trains in World Two, what service do you think? Ever, well, what service do you think you'll enjoy the most? I mean, I know we haven't seen it yet or any of that. But do you think you'll be more of a Gatwick Express person, more of a Southern, you know, stop in, or maybe even the Branch Line person? Air Salford Station. Uh, just found your Xbox One S. Can I use the same account to play Train Sim World 2? Um, well, if you've played it before on your Xbox on that account, then yeah. Right, get Sir Poe. Fair enough. I'll be Hawley next, and once we get, once we see Hawley, we're going to start slowing down, as Hawley is just before Gatwick. Do you play much of the South Eastern route anymore? Uh, I still play it, it's just, um, well, it's just, it's, it's, uh, there's quite a few routes now on um, TSW2 to play, so it just doesn't come up as often. Fair enough, Neil, GWR service, that's the layout, fair enough. <laughs> now I would want me to stop. Right, you can see Hawley Station, I believe, coming up now. See, that's the one of the noticeable differences in TS when you look in the distance from sort of here. You can't obviously see as much detail. Whereas, obviously, on TSW, you can. Awesome British train spotter. I didn't actually wear the Thames Inc. livery, well, unless you're on about the old Thames Inc. livery. But the 319s didn't wear the... Uh, well, it wasn't really. I mean, it literally was the first Capital Connect livery with a Thames Inc. sticker over it. And they did actually do some to sort of the grey. But there wasn't many. Here's Hawley. Yeah, we're going to switch over to the 387 once we get to Gatwick and we'll head down to uh, Brighton. So this part of the route now is sort of where I know, you know, this is, I know more of this area than, you know, past Red Hill. Oh, awesome, Ashton. Well, it's a brilliant route, South Eastern. Down to 40 as we cross the tracks. So, yeah, about half of the Gatwick Express services only go from Victoria to Gatwick and then they but they just turn around and go back. Um, but the other sort of half then continue down to Brighton. Which train is this? Uh, this is the class 442. Maybe at some point, Kobe, when the Brighton Main Line comes out. Now we might do an eight hour stream or something. Can't, yeah, you can, King Carrot. That's fine, mate. Coming in on platform one by the looks of things. Fair enough, John. 
It's making a popping sound. And there's a plane. So you get like in this game that's completely different to how it well how it is now. A popping what is that? Um yeah, Gatwick looks a lot more different now. But this is set in 2012. But I think the station was rated like the worst. One of the worst stations in the UK. I won't say it's a pleasant station. I'm not sure if you just had a little bit of bang. I just whacked the mic. But we are a 10 coach train, so. There's an 8 car marker there. I'm just going to go to the 10 coach if there is one. There it is. Yeah, it's nice, isn't it, to, um, Rob, holding sort of square or X if you're on the Xbox to do two-tone. Oh, see Kobe. Uh, British Train Spotter. Here we are. We made it. This is Gatwick Airport. Right, what we're going to do is we're not going to continue the scenario. We're going to back out. Let's hope the game doesn't crash when I do this. Uh, you can see what I was doing last night there. Um, actually, that was for a meadow, I think, that one. Um, Brighton Mainline. Brighton Mainline, where are you? Probably because I've got it set to the Acetta at the moment. Yeah, if I change that to the 387. Oh, I see you, yeah, little rubbish. Yeah, we're going to go in the AP class. 387 which is there uh, and we're going to do it in hmm let's see where's Gatwick Express on here 387 yeah that's the right one isn't it Gatwick Express there oh, there's Gatwick Express there we're doing 8 car that's sort of the well that is pretty much the standard uh, Brighton Main Line and we'll do Gatwick Airport to Brighton Fast uh, all to 9 o'clock in the morning yeah we may as well, let's do it. Yeah, no worries, Mantis, mate. You won't do another eight-hour stream. As you said, you was going to do one on most routes, but I haven't. Well, the realistic shift times are different. And obviously on uh, Boston Sprinter, it's not like a closed network. Um, obviously, the thing on Kafka was a closed network. That's why we did the shift on it. With the Brighton Main Line, that is sort of a closed network for some of the services. So we'll do a long stream on that most likely. But how is well hopefully everyone's all well. We've got forty people in, so thanks all for coming in. Right, we're now in the three eight seven. Obviously this is coming to train some well too with the Brighton main line. It's been a while since I've been in this one. Let's do that. Uh set that. And you gotta wait, it loads up. There we go. Uh, we're going to come over to this screen here. Uh, we're going to do it as... No, we're not going to do that. Pretty certain they still have guards on them. Um, right, I need to put my driver ID in. So, for, I don't know, let's put... Uh, how many subs are we on? 3,715, I think. At least we were. Let's enter that. There we go. And uh, for the root code, uh, what's for Brighton? I think a thousand's Victoria. I think it was 2,000 for Brighton. What's that? London Victoria. We're not going there. Sounds good, Josh. Yeah, I'll accept it um, after this, mate. Awesome, John. Lovely service. German Hill. Awesome. Uh, yeah, let's put 2,000 in. Right. Uh, what, what, what's the one for Brighton? Ameda. What's the one for Brighton again? I know we did it before. Um, let's try... 1001. Hey, there we go, Brighton. Right. Let's get the doors open. Oh, that's... There you go. It's got a lovely, it's got a very relaxing interior to it, the 387. It's got the red seats with the turquoisey handrails. Although, look at the seats, the ironing boards. So you pay, you pay extra money. Um, to get on the Gatwick Express in real life as it's a premium service and it's been in iron imports. I'd rather go on a 377 
Which, uh, there's not really a big time difference. But the, Gal the Galactic Express is realistically a way to scam tourists. F out of 7 hours. Uh, what is the stream after this so I can join? It's going to be train small to on rapid transit. Right, let's... Um, my headlights are on. We've got 217, the track light as well. Uh, let's get the DRA off. Uh, let's send that in as well. Yeah, the guard would have done the buzzer, so we'll do it as well. Let's go. And yeah, big thanks to Amela who actually uh, did gift us this. Let's go. Let's get that off. Ah, oh, see you, Mr. Quicko. But yeah, heading down to Brighton now. It's about 20 minutes down there. Look at that. Yeah, the Electro Stars all are fairly similar. Cool. But yeah, coming out of Gatwick Airport. Yeah, sounds good. <laughs> Just since I was dying. I don't blame them. But yeah, look at that, it's brilliant. There's the airport. Let's go, full whack. There's the runway, literally just there. Let's get the window open. Yeah, not for long though, British train spot. I was about sort of, you know, a month, two months. Not long. Off we go. It's got a slightly more modern AWS. It's got the same sort of AWS tone to the 395. Similar to that. Can do uh, after this uh, British train spot, mate. Fair enough, J. Luke. I don't get it. It's, it's supposed to be an express premium service, and it's ironing boards. And these things aren't really ever busy, busy. So I don't see why they have to be ironing boards. I mean, yeah, if you're uh, sort of just a person going to work, go on the seven hundred. They're the busy ones. I oh, see. Right, next station stop. Well, we're not stopping there, but that is Three Bridges. Which I've been... Well, I go there many times in real life. Quite frequently. Oh, I see, Josh. There's the new quarter yard there. Uh, you get uh, a, well, quite a, a daily sort of freight train in there. I think there's one or two freight trains a day. Which go in, so they usually see them sort of come into here and stop, and then they obviously reverse in. As I've been sat in the park, which is coming up here quite a few times, actually, it was only a couple of days ago, so a class 66 waiting to reverse in. Which they pretty much block up the whole main line for sort of five minutes, or at least the up fast. Yeah, I'm sitting in there, see the freight trains coming into here, and then they reverse in. There's a 375, a 377-5. Yeah, Melon. <laughs> Alright, let's get ahead. Here's Free Bridges Station. Yeah, I've been here many times in real life. Yes, Pete. And in real life, this whole area here is like a massive... Well, even here, it's the Thameslink Depot, and you've got the Network Rail, Free Bridges Signalling Centre. It's just a massive complex now. But I'm sure we'll probably see that in uh, in TSW2, which obviously this one is set in 2012. <laughs> You're on a travel van. Cool. Comes down to 80 near Balkan Tunnel. 
When the train front passed the sound cut out, where's the game sound gone? Hopefully it's not. Is the game sound gone? Hopefully not. There's the M23. Naturally coming down to 80. Oh, one thing we didn't actually do. It's a bit naughty. We haven't set up the GSMR radio. Uh-oh, that's... Um, yeah, that'll be alright. Uh, not yet, Josh. No, not yet. We'll do it now. A bit cheeky, but... Um, <laughs> hmm. Uh, let's, um, yeah, you should do this when you start, but I, I forgot, alright? <laughs> we'll just do that. Oh, okay, that's a good one, Pete. Yeah, a bit naughty. He's welcome to your fired. Probably would be if that was real life, yeah. I Meant you wouldn't be on the thing, would you? So it'd be very dangerous. Well, I doubt you would actually be able to control the train if you hadn't put that in. So. Hello, Glenn. How are you, mate? You've already missed the exciting part when we went past uh, a certain station. Up to 90 again in a second. That's <laughs> it. But yeah, we are on the class 387. And this one is coming to train some world too. You're rehired. How come in this unit you can push the buttons, but in the same one I have got, I can't, and that is in TS. Well, this is Armstrong Powerhouse. Yeah. What was that? I think that was the GSMR. This is over here, Mantis. Yeah, this is the GSMR radio. Which was, I should have set up one right back at the beginning, but I forgot. <laughs> um, that wouldn't be a good excuse, would it? The manager calls you in. Why didn't you set up the GSMR radio? Oh, I forgot. Yeah, I don't think you'd be part of the company for long. Could do, Mr. Quicko. There's Balkum. Made sure to be late. Yes, yeah, the GSMR radio, so if we're stuck at a red light, we press uh, SG and it would contact the signaler and say, you know, what's going on. We'll see if it's more than two minutes. Should be going over the Ooze Valley Viaduct in a second, or the Balkan Viaduct. He was 28 minutes behind, what, on the stream, Permian? Try and move, yeah. Yeah, you think maybe. Yeah, I mean, in real life, I suppose the signal wouldn't go green until you have set up the GSMR, as you wouldn't be registered on the system. Look at you, Pivers. There's some hard radio. Here's the Ooze Valley Viaduct, which on Flight Sim is just a shadow on the ground. Transport for Wales, don't I? Oh, it's Hepermian. Yeah, that's a good um, British train spot. You always get one or two. Is, uh, is that the AP one, Josh? We're in the 387. You might be in the 377. Then you've got the Arding Lie branch, which goes off, I believe, here around there. Yeah, there's the Arding Lie branch there. It's just, it's, I don't think it's even a mile. Get a little bit right there. To an ASMR live stream of TSW2. That's weird, King Carrot. Don't know. Why that's done that? Yeah, oh, I don't know, Josh. Um. Well, press the button here, which will sort of activate, and then you can put the code in. And you 
quite a few views on here. Now through Hayward Heath. Awesome uh, Permian. Very relaxing atmosphere in the train though. There's a 319. And it's a Hayward Heath Tunnel. <laughs> it's an awesome car. Hello Aaron, what class 377 version will we be getting in the Brighton Mainline route? Oh, on Train Tomorrow 2, the 377 4, and I believe the 377 1. But the 377-1 is pretty much the same. Um, it's going to be the slightly newer dash ones, which obviously have the well, the newer headlight clusters to them. But it's nice to have a bit of you know, you know, dash ones as well. Looking forward to it. Right, it'll be Withersfield next we passing. What is the low cut? This is the class three eight seven, Josh. Let's, uh, was that? Let's get a flyby shot. I think there's a whistle board around here, I think, somewhere. Yeah, I think there's a whistle board around here. It's like the only one on the line. Yeah, here's the whistle board. And yeah, it is, it's the only one on the line, I believe. That'd be cool, uh, Permian. We are coming up on Withersfield Station. Let's get a flyby shot through here. It's on a corner, so it'll look good. Cool. Now you've got the line off to Lewis there. Obviously, the Kima branch. Obviously, that goes Plumpton, Cooksbridge, and then Lewis. And here's Burgess Hill Station. Here we go, we are going a bit too quick now. There you go. Uh, this is Armstrong Powerhouse, Josh. Yeah, this is an AP pack. camera view as well, there's the GSMR view all the lights up there, the screen and that one further back yeah that's further back isn't it, we won't sit in like that there we go Austin Mr Quicko right, coming up on Hassock station Uh, you can see the South Downs coming up as well. We'll be going under them in a second. Awesome, Oscar. Yeah, here's Hassock Station. Which is pretty much at the base of the Downs. So we'll be coming up on Clayton Tunnel shortly, uh, which obviously does have the iconic tunnel portal, which we'll see why in a second if you haven't seen it before. It's um, pretty awesome. Yes, yeah, it's a quick drive. I don't think anyone's made a scenario for the AP one. That'd be cool though. Like the early morning one that stops at Hayward Sea for something. Yeah, here is uh, the Clayton Tunnel Northern portal. Obviously, yeah, pretty iconic. That. 
and then we go. And once we're out of here, we're sort of, you know, on the home stretch to Brighton. Do I have acted up? Ah. But we will be finished once we get to Brighton. But thanks all for coming in. Obviously, if you have enjoyed the stream, do leave a like, do subscribe, and do thank Davidoff. We did actually pick today's stream. And obviously, big thanks again for your donation, Davidoff. Much appreciated. But we'll be on rapid transit about 20 minutes after this on Train Sim World 2. And can we get up to 35 likes? We've got 31 at the moment. Out we go. Speed does come down to 75 soonish. Not yet, uh, Metro, mate. Yeah, not yet. Cool. Well, I let it come down naturally. How do I find the AP Power Pack on Steam? And how do I? F it's not on Steam, Josh. It's on uh, their own website, a website, I believe. Hello, simulation dog. Oh, quite old then, 1903 and 04. There's a 75, which we're pretty much going at now. So we're going to Patchum Tunnel in a second. Should have the A23 directly to our left. So you can see the A23 there, and that goes on to the A27, which is here, and then to Brighton over there. Yeah, it has Permian. Obviously, the GWE on this game is set in 20, well, on TSW is set in 2015, and on this game, I think it's about 2010 or something like that, it's set. Armstrong Powerhouse, Josh. Are you planning on doing more D-Roll Valley live streams and videos? Sure am, Devon. Yeah, sure am, mate. Just trying to find the time for for it. Yeah, we'll, 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 we'll be back on it. But I might even do that as tomorrow's video. down although tomorrow there might only be one stream and same on Monday there might just be one stream We've got a few bits to um well yeah a few bits to do all right Preston Park coming up I start bringing it down to 40 is that another train there is that a 319 I think that might be a 319 they have very bright headlights on here Awesome Permian. Yeah, here's Preston Park Station. It's almost at Brighton now. At one point, uh, Santa Fe and Southern Pacific almost merged. Ah, hello Nick, how are you, mate? They've got the line off to Hove, obviously the sort of Hove triangle that goes through Cliftonville Tunnel. There's the 40 and it's down to 25 next. you got Lover's Walk Depot. Yeah, good to Nick. Let's bring that down a bit more. Down it goes. But yeah, thanks all for watching uh, today's Train Sim stream. Also, we'll be on Train Sim World uh, fairly shortly after this. 
and I'll be doing some rapid transit for about an hour. Cool. Coming in on platform six at Brighton. I'm not too sure, Josh. Up to you, mate. Depends what you like more. Good to hear, Nick. You can hear a train on there. Why is that on the East Coast, do I? There's a 319 on the East Coast, do I, there? Obviously, that route is on trains some well, too. Yeah, I'll be getting Boston 21 there, uh, Nick. Yeah, it's good, Nick, Miller. But yeah, this is uh, where we will be terminating. Obviously, it all change. Awesome, uh, Munchies. <laughs> screenshot time. Good, have got a screenshot. But would have been a bit weird seeing a 3 at 7 in Galk Express delivery and a 319 together. Hello Rafael, is this Rush Hour? Well, this route is coming with Rush Hour, but this is the train simulator version of it in the 387. I don't mind, uh, Mr. Cooker, mate. Up to you, mate. Is that 319 coming on platform 7? Oh my god, look at him! He did that on purpose, didn't he? He wanted to do the first one there. I mean, that is dangerous. <laughs> Here we are. What a crazy driver. But here we are, we have made it to Brighton. There we go. And that does conclude today's um, today's train simulator stream. Hopefully everyone has enjoyed it. Obviously if you did, do thank Davidoff. He did actually pick today's, uh, today's stream. Um, but yeah, uh, thanks all for coming in. Obviously you will find a link in the description to the Discord server, to the PayPal and to the merch store if you do want to help support the channel. Awesome, Mr. Quicko. Uh, but thanks all for coming in, and I hopefully we'll see you. Right, hang a second. Yes, we do have a 20% sale in the in the merch store. Obviously, use the code SUMMER20, all in capitals. I put it in the chat, and you can get 20% off in there. Some brilliant products in there. 20% off until September the 22nd. But thanks all for coming in, and I hopefully we'll see you. It was fast, yeah. See you in the next one. See you all, and take care. Bye, guys. And you do have to see me doing that. And there we go. See ya.